uh, YouTube guys are on. Samantha is the first one here on Facebook. Six feet of separation is on. How are we doing, guys? Thanks for jumping on on YouTube. We're going to be, um, you know, simultaneously streaming tonight. We're going to do the best we can for you guys, okay? Hi, Karen, how are you? Lindsay, George, Car Heather Hendricks here. David Sinclair's watching. Jane Miller. So, what we've got, we've got YouTube guys who are watching. Hi, Joan, Julie, Tracy. Thanks for coming on. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. We enjoyed this tonight. We're in a uh, we're a little bit early starting, but it's uh, it's gonna get good as we're gonna go on. So we've we've got a good location for you tonight, guys. Uh, many might know uh, the location when you see it. A lot many might be familiar with it when we should go in and we investigate. You know, bear in mind there will be people still in there when we go in, but. Um, we are in a room upstairs and it will things will quieten down as the night progresses yes. okay so people has been getting that onto youtube that's what we're going to be doing we're going to be we're going to go in there and see what we can do really this is, we've heard all the stories of what you know the stories related to the hauntings you know we've it's all it's all documented we've all we've all done the research these spirits are walking around the rooms at night taps are turned on by themselves and things like that are happening so this is really good stuff guys you know it's going to be good stuff let's see if we can capture some of this weird stuff um we should be live after 10 p.m yeah we don't we don't end we don't tend to be turning off at 10 p.m we can kind of keep it going as long as we can. You know what I mean? So, uh, Carla's with me as well. Hi, everyone. <laughs> Still, it's hard. It's hard work. Yeah. It's hard work. Yeah, doing it on its own. So, what we're going to do first? We're going to take you for a little bit of a walk round where we are. Guesses for where? You know, just get, just guess. Leave a guesses in the comment as where we are. So we flipped them round. So here we go. The shambles, oh, yeah. This is like the really old Victorian streets. Oh, yeah, by the way, guys, yeah, thanks for all your messages regarding the health. I've been really poorly in this past week, but I have really got over it. So, yeah, this is where we are, guys. These are the old. Maybe we can purchase that tomorrow. You're only on YouTube, we can have thousands of people that way about it. Oh, that was stealthy, that one. Can you manage it? Yeah, of course I can. <laughs> I like to call content. War medals. Oh my god. <laughs> Can we get this in video? Oh 
more stamina than me, these guys. <laughs> I see a building. We could. So what we're going to do, we're going to have a little, little walk of these old Victorian streets of York, and then we're going to go back to the, the hotel, the notoriously haunted hotel, and we're going to get, see what we can do. It's as simple as that. That's what we're going to do. I'm going to tear you on this one. So we've rolled it like that. Okay then, guys. Right, because I'm a bit, um, a bit far away, I've got the camera now, guys. Just do it best I can because I'm dual streaming. I've got them on Facebook and I'm on YouTube as and well. Dodging cobbling streets. And dodging cobbling <laughs> streets. And it's claimed a few already today. Yeah. It's claimed a life already, <laughs> these streets. So it's all going to be good, guys. So we've got. Um, we're going to be. Uh, we're going to take you for this little walk around these old streets. And then. And there, the Morris dancers screaming. I think they're enjoying themselves a little bit too much. Maybe that's something I need to do. Maybe that might cheer me up. I don't know. Oh. And then... And then we're going to go. Yeah, you, I've got your YouTube, I've got you, yeah, I understand you can't hear me, but I'm holding the phone now so you can hear me. We haven't got a setup like most on today, so we do his best with what we've got. Here we go, guys, we're coming. Yeah, everyone on YouTube, please leave a like on the video, subscribe if you haven't. People on Facebook, if you're new, like the page, keep it. Uh, Keep this uh, dream alive. More people that shows the support, the more um, we, you know we can grow, we can get better, we can get out to a more audience. It's all good stuff. I'm just nearly going to get run over by a bike. So we're just going to take you to the vocal point of York, where we are. Going to get everyone. Get through these streets, don't they? These old streets get rowdy for me. Look at that lot. Your favourite shop here, Carla? Oh, yeah. We, uh, you're all your um, thunder crackers and uh, <laughs> rain, rain pipes and <laughs> rain, rain, sticks. rain sticks and pan pipes and you name it. Hey, vintage man's clothing here, we like this. We like that. I'd wear a cravat, me, if I could get away with it. It's all good stuff, guys. It's all good stuff. Content for tonight's investigation in one of most haunted hotels, pubs, most haunted investigated there in 2005. Ooh. Here we are, York Cathedral. Wouldn't we like to do an investigation in there? Can't even get cameras high enough to look at it. To have a look at established the beauty. I'm going to come in here tomorrow and just going to do an investigation in it. Don't care. I'll leave them a 50p tip. Yeah. This. England. This is the UK 
guys, people overseas who want to appreciate some architecture. Oh no, someone's taking my job here, guys. Yeah. Oh, we've been followed around by that guy, all right. So, oh, God, I can't. I'm going to have to stand in the middle of the road, aren't I? So, this is it, guys. York Cathedral. Absolutely epic building. So, what we're going to do now, guys, we're going to head back to the hotel. Um, we're going to go back into Lady Peckett's room who is apparently haunts the room at night and turns taps on and slams doors and pulls your hair and things like that. She can pull my hair tonight if she wants. If she wants to, if she wants to pull my hair, she can. I welcome it. Guy Thorks in. Apparently was born here. Guy Fawkes born here, 1517. Guy Fawkes born here, 1517. I told them that. <laughs> they didn't know how, they didn't find that information off a wall, did they? They got it off me. A lot of tourists here guys and it's quite weird because like when you live from these areas you find it odd why people but then we'll go to their countries and do exactly the same thing yeah we photobombed plenty of photos in the, in the, we've got we're in plenty like pulling strange poses and things like that Ghost walk. Where does one go on a ghost walk? If so, if you guys are interested, in all seriousness, if you guys are interested in coming for a ghost, uh, a ghost walk, there's one here every night at 7:30. No, it starts at half past. Seven. Oh yes, yeah, so it says it like that, don't it? But if you are going to come to York, okay, guys, York, I'm, I'm not affiliated with York in any way, and they are not. Do you know the way back to it? Through, here Through there. Through here, through shambles, we need to go. <laughs> I'd be lost about 10 times today. Absolutely useless. True story, guys, is when we went to it, two hours to get out of it. True story. You asked. Craig Liver. So what we're doing now guys, for those who are walking back, um, who's just joining us in, sorry, at York Sweet Shop. Um, we're gonna back, go ahead back to the hotel now. I just wanted to give you guys a little introduction of where we are, you know, um, you know, get some faces in while we um yeah, this, this, you know, if the signal is going, just refresh, we are. We're out in the out and about. We might the signal might dip and things like that. You know, we've got to work with what we've got. We've got to work with what we've got. Car, we behind me. Jesus, the car can wait for me. We're going back to the Morris dancers now, guys. We're back on YouTube, right? Going to, we're going to see the, we're going to see the rather enthusiastic uh, Morris dancers. Okay, let's all in the chat. Let's give them some love because they've got some absolute confidence. I'm going to say something else then, but just do that. But seems a fun thing to do. I would never. 
uh, discredit anyone from doing a fun thing. You know, I'm open for everyone to do whatever they want to do. There's things I do what other people might find strange themselves. So let's give these Morris dancers some love. But I've got to show you this, we're in York guys, okay? This is a silver near shop in, Yun, Lund, um, <laughs> in York, okay? I think this silver near shop thinks we're in London, but uh, that's just one thing. Absolutely fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. Absolute talent. There we go. I'm promoting the ghost hunt here. The ghost walk. I'm giving that some love. I'm throwing my passion behind that. A lot of, we've got a lot of... Uh, for um, any Harry Potter fans out there, there's a lot of... Um, a lot of... Harry Potter shop themed so, and you have to they loved that didn't they they really enjoyed that bless them they enjoyed it I'm glad they did I'm really it's very really, really made me uh, it's enlightened some happiness inside this dark soul knowing that uh, they've enjoyed doing that. Look at these original houses. Wow. I give them 10 years before they all fall over. Because <laughs> they just keep moving, don't they? Every time I come to York, they've moved about a foot. I tell you what, guys, this is where we're staying here. Um, staying. <laughs> if you want to know a Cinderella, a Cinderella um, what's her name? Alice in Wonderland house. Yeah. Um, yeah, that'd be it. It's pretty crackers, guys, in here. So here we're going, guys. Ooh. Plenty of People come to York, guys. It's um, Amy, your mate said you're near a Viking pub or something. Does that mean anything to you? Valhalla. You think, yeah, that's the one. Put the camera down, we're not getting anyone in the camera. <laughs> there we go, right, we can pick them back up. This is where we are, guys, tonight, okay. Okay. This is where Phil Sinclair Investigations will be tonight. And I've got a big smell of Mara, <laughs> a, a, a drug substance we won't promote on camera. But this is where we are. Okay, a little bit of history. The Golden Fleece was mentioned. I'm not going to read it, but we can just scroll down like a Star Wars film. I hope this brings back fun memories for you, Linda, for your honeymoon. Okay. And these, where we're going to take you now, is the five ghosts of where we hit, where we are tonight. Okay. So we've got Lady Alice. Okay. Jeff Monroe. He's located on the third. What floor are we on? The third floor? Know. He might be on his floor tonight. Um there we've got that one. Um small child. 
But this is the woman where we are. Lady Alice Peckett. Said to be found roaming the endless corridors and staircases. Maybe we'll um, we'll get that tonight. Yeah, the signal will come back, just keep refreshing. Um, right, we'll see what we get signal we get inside. So we've got the uh, most haunted uh, thing there. And then we're in, we'll poke it down so we don't get everyone in the town in there. Original floors, etc. Uh, and then here we go down into here. Oops, oh, sorry, love. And then we've got that. We'll not go down there because there seems to be some kind of weird function or something. And where, we, where we'll go is we'll go up here. Up. Oh, right. Can I manage walking up these lopsided stairs? We've got two cameras. No, I just can't get the other one, but it's just a little Here we go. We're going up. Yeah. Well, what it is, I've got a rope set up. <laughs> okay, so this is the room we're in. Okay, we're in here. Um, yeah. Where was that other room? You know, the room that's supposed to be really bad. Have we gone that's past the very it? Bottom, yeah. Very bottom. This is the. Okay, but there's apparently there's a room which is really notoriously haunted, isn't there, where people really don't like being. Now, what I want Carla to do here is I want you to show this doorway. Okay. And I want to show how one gets into here. Oh, oh, we're in. Oh, we're in. We've got somebody in. Imagine. Surprise me. Come on in. Welcome to my humble abode. There we go. Ladies and gentlemen, we've entered you into such privacy. Oh yes. Right. Here we are. Let's show them around. That's the bathroom. I'll close that. There's nothing there. Uh, uh. So this is the, you know, this wouldn't have been, well would it have been a room? Apparently this lady Peckett lived in this room. So if she's here tonight and she wants to talk to us or she wants to throw anything or you know pulling people's hair or if there's anybody she doesn't like me in any way or you know let us know let us know you're here and this is what we can do so we've got a little bit of information inside here um just, just gives a little bit of rundown of the hauntings um two single beds i like to keep it classic um, <laughs> Um, okay, hauntings. The feeling of being strangled has been reported by both staff, customers standing near Merchant's Bar. This is believed to be connected to a previous landlord who hanged himself from a hook now hidden by a false ceiling. This is our last here. This is our last. This is what we want. Lady Peckett, Lady Alice Peckett owned the Golden Fleece from around 1701 with her husband John Peckett, the Lord Mayor of York. She is said to walk the corridors and staircases in the early hours of the morning, awakening our guests with the sound of her footsteps. Whether the lady appears, whether the lady appears, the witnesses have remarked on how, the, on a sweet smell of perfume that seems to accompany her. 
what you're getting is you are getting my multi uh, education <laughs> Yeah, uh, the airman, possibly the most famous ghost, is Jeff Monroe, a Canadian airman, who was staying at the pub in a room with four when he died in 1945 by throwing himself, falling out of the window as people staying in his former room are frightened by his figure, oh God, in full uniform standing over them, his icy touch having woken them from their slumbers. One-Eyed Jack. On several occasions, guests have reported the presence of a ghost known as One-Eyed Jack. Jack, a late 17th century red-coated, big-wigged gentleman, carried a flint lock pistol and paces up and down the merchant's bar whilst mm. his in intentions are <laughs> unknown. It's said that he died in this building. Well, Jack... If you're here, mate, we'll talk to you tonight, if you like. The young boy, during the 19th century, a young boy was killed outside the inn by a brewery, Dray, Dry, also believed to have been named Jack. He has been sighted in the front cellar of the pub under the shambles bar in the merchant's bar. I don't know if that's the pickpocket, that one. Mm. This is... This is... The MVP, I think. This mm. is the... Um, this is... This is the main event player, this one. Yep. The ghost cat. One ghost everybody can see is that of a cat. Go to the front of the building and look up. You can see it emerging through the wall. We'll go out when it gets dark and see if you can see the cat. It's part of the York Cat Trail and it is a good omen. The ghost of a cat will only appear if it thinks the building is in a happy place. Mm. Beware of the ghosts. So then, ghosts, I want your attention, please. And if there's any ghosts in this room that want to, who haven't, who's been very patient with us so far, maybe you uh, can uh, do something for us, okay? You know, we we want you to we want you want what we want to see. We want to see what you can do for us, okay? We want to see what all these guests have been witnessing. We want to see, you know, we want to we want, we've got some devices here for you, and we want you to do something. We've got I you know I'm very interested in the paranormal. I think if you're still here, um, maybe you can um, do something, okay, Lady uh, Peckett. My love, if you're still here. You can't really get an idea of how like sort of wonky it is in here either, can you? The beds we're trying to like The bed <laughs> the beds here, okay, are like on a a like on Mount Everest. <laughs> like an incline. Um it's like um You go up here and then you whoa I need a uh, I need a, a rope to get up it. <laughs> it's pretty crazy. We have got, um... Carla's been trying to get me pissed off. <laughs> I have not. Um, but that, that's uh, failing miserably. Okay. Uh, we've also, I'd like to add that we've got a, um... A wonky lamp. We've got something there. That's nice and light for your spirits to, um, move for us, if you can. Um, so I want to see some action, you know, I've come here, I've come to York, I've finally uh, left my street, and I've, uh, I want to come and I want to see some uh, some action from you guys, okay? So we're having that right off, okay? We want to get this room as dark as possible. I see there's a really big gap underneath the door as well there. Look. We're going to shut this window, because Crazy. we don't want any contamination from outside coming in okay and what we're gonna do we're gonna shut these curtains like oh they're not gonna see much of it but we'll turn my light on it's probably gonna slide back down that yeah, <laughs> it's it's the really, yeah. i'm not holding the camera like any wonky way Don't it's just that is what curtains. it is so okay right 
So we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna lower the lights a minute. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna make it am ambient for these people. We're gonna drop it a bit. And we wanna see we wanna see. We wanna see Lady Peggy if this is a room. You know, we wanna see it. We wanna see your manifest dog. We wanna we wanna know you're here. See what we've got here as well. We've got a nice uh, Nice crack on the door to pass with that sort of guys, mm. you can see. So we've got a nice, so we might do an ex experiment in a bit. Do you know, we'd like to see if we can get any, any, you know, anything walking past the or anything. The ghost cat walking past The ghost cat or anything like that. So and what I want to do is I want to stir some stuff up. Do you know what I mean? I want people, I need, I want, I want them to know that I'm talking to these people directly. And I want to know that, like, you know, I want to talk to them. Okay, they've probably been seeing. I didn't realise that's how I how much privacy have I got with yep. this here? Yeah, they can see me in bed with that. <laughs> Not happy with that, but it's good because we go. Oh, is that coming up? Someone coming upstairs? No. Okay, so where I'd like to add as well, guys, we are. Um, Upstairs, so we're in the guest area. So no, no public people should unless they're in the, unless they're in the unless next room. Unless we're in the very end room. At the yeah. Top there that you've just been up so we're we're up three three flights of stairs. This is not a customer area, you know. This is not. So if we're in thumping outside, the room is either going to be so, a guest or a member of staff or somebody who's lost. Who knows? Or that lady earlier, that American lady. Or the American lady, which we were following us up as well. I think she wanted a cup of tea, though, to be honest. <laughs> I think you did. Um, I, think she, I think she wanted to have a little Nebrat room, to be honest. But, um, um, yeah, it's going to be stuff. Yeah, guys, we're going to we're gonna investigate, guys, you know. Just be patient with us, you know. Do you know what I mean? I, I like to, um, you know, I like to have a bit of, inject a little bit of humour as well, you know. I don't like to be all seriousness about things. You know, let's enjoy it and let's see what we can get. So there you go. So, in all seriousness... Lady Peckett, you're the spirit I've chose to speak to tonight. I welcome anyone, any other spirit, to come and talk to us tonight. I will be using a series of devices. These devices will enable you to speak to us. Okay? You just do what you need to do. When I ask questions, you answer them. My devices will pick them up, okay? You talk. Tell us why you're still here. If you are absolutely furious that I'm in this room, and if you don't like me in any way, let me know. Maybe you do. Did you assess that? No. Did you hear a voice? I were only breathing, but no, not heard anything. I had like a woman's vo- <laughs> That were a bit weird from the get go. Okay. You are right next to my ear, like a- <gasps> No. No, I've only been breathing, but I am That's doing that in your ear. <laughs> you like something just went- <gasps> Like that, right next to me okay. here. That went like, but you would have, you would have had a bit of it yet, you done that. Yeah. Oh, fucking weird. You were like, here, next to me. Yeah. Right, it's brilliant stuff. I want you to move something. I want you to get, gather all the, uh, the energy in this room. And I want you to, I want you to, I want you to do something for me. I want you to, like, I want you, I want you to make me the most famous paranormal investigator the UK has ever known. All right. And I want you to do it right now. I want you to make me famous right now. Okay? I'll be sleeping in this bed tonight. Okay? And I, 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 
I'd love it if you could throw me out of this bed. Carla wouldn't. I don't want you to do anything to Carla. Yeah, okay. thanks. I don't want anything to happen to Carla. I am not... Carla is merely a guest on this investigation, helping me. But, so I will pleasely, kindly ask that you do not bother Carla. You can bother me in any way. You know? You can do whatever you... But that were weird. I, uh, I don't know if you could camera pick that up or what. But that were... Um, that were... That were crackers. Like right in me ear. Hmm. Was that your spirit? Are you making yourself known now? It said that you walk around these rooms and corridors and that. I don't believe there's nobody in here, mate. I reckon it's all stories. I think these are just all... These are just all fairy tales. They're just all fairy tales. There's nobody in here. There's nobody. What we'll do, we'll set the REM pod up. Absolute fairy tales. So what we're going to do, guys, is we've got the REM pod. Okay. Disc set light. Okay, so what we've got... So that, that is me touching it. Mm-hmm. And that is going to affect it, okay? That is picking up an EMF source, basically. And that EMF source is me touching it. So we're going to put that in the doorway. There. Right, so if Lady Peckett wants to come in and wants to chuck stuff about at us, or, you know... If cat what, wants to come in and have a look. cat wants to come in, or Guy Monroe wants to come in and strangle one of us, or... But it's all good stuff. Top fan badges coming in on Facebook. If you get the opportunity, hit the top fan badges. YouTube guys, thanks so much for watching this. Subscribe, um, like. You know the drill. You know the drill. You know the drill. You've just got to help me out on these things. I really appreciate that you people are in here watching me do this. It's absolutely, you know, it's humbling to know. That you know, it's uh, there's tons and tons of paranormal teams out there doing the exact same thing, and you've decided to stay with me, which cannot be thanked for enough. So come on then, let's get the mel meter. I do hope I'm not. <laughs> there's nobody trying to sleep upstairs. Hey, she's alive. Mel's alive. So this is the same as the REM uh, meter, uh, REM pod on the floor. So this is going to uh, detect an EMF source. Guys familiar on the show Ghost Adventures. Um... Well, no, we'll see these devices, you know, and it's it's why I own them, you know. It's I'm, I'm a fan of the paranormal myself. I watch the TV shows myself. <coughs> so what I want is I want any spirit, ghost, cat or not, to walk through the door, please. These stories about all oh, the people walking through corridors <coughs> and guests being attacked in rooms and things like that. Can I see that, please? Are you happy where you are? You know, are you happy? Are you, are you happy the state the building is in? Are you? Um, you know, is it, it, 
Or are you angry about it, you know? Are you absolutely seething? Just let us know. I'll be using these devices soon where you can talk to us. Okay, but we're going to give it a little baseline sweep. Um, I feel as though something weird has happened already while being in here. Come on, let's see some action in here, yeah? Don't let me go back to South Yorkshire disappointed, <coughs> all right? Maybe the action happens at night, you know? Maybe the action will happen when I'm asleep. Maybe I will have to get out of bed in the middle of the night and start live streaming this shit. You know? Maybe this is what I need to be doing. Maybe these people aren't puppets and they will not, you know, perform. Um, on command. Or, maybe nothing will happen and that is absolutely fine. Because on every paranormal investigation, we won't get everything, anything, everything happening on every investigation. Okay? Maybe we can have a night off. I don't want it. You know? But <coughs> there's no bullshit with Phil Sinclair's paranormal investigations. Okay. Have you heard something then? Because I have. Activity it's like heavy feet outside doorway. There is music at the moment, guys. We think it's a band downstairs, so don't. I think, I believe that yeah. That's just Phil, don't worry. going to do is we're going to try an EVP, okay? Are you going to be okay holding two, Carla? Yep. I, I'm not giving you As long as it's pass. in the right place, that is fair. <coughs> like, that like that. Please excuse me, I am absolutely wet through in sweat. But it's nice and quiet in this room. We might be all right. Okay, we would love to have the entire building, but we're not. Um, mm -hmm. We only can work with what we've got. Okay, EVP. Let's try and get something. <coughs> trying to get some kind of voices tonight. We are now recording. Any spirits in this room? Whose attention we may have got? Can you confirm you are here with us? Is there a lady pecket here with us, please? Is there a 
Mr. Monroe here. <clears throat> Any spirits in this room whose attention we may have got? Can you confirm you are here with us? Is there a lady packet here with us, please? Is there a Mr. Monroe here? Mr. Monroe here? Interesting, so <clears throat> again. I will ask again if there's a Lady Pecky or any other spirit that resides within this notoriously haunted building, can you say yes or no, please? Can you tell us your name? Is there anybody in this room with us? Should we fear anyone in this room? If you have anything to say at all, please say so now. Gonna wind that back. Yep. <clears throat> so what I like to do, guys, I like to do a like a minute bursts. I'll ask again. If there's a lady pecky or any other spirit that resides within this notoriously haunted building, can you say yes or no, please? There's a whisper or something. Thank you. 
little bits, a little bit, but I can't mm. like this device here. See the red light here. Talk to me here, please. Can you tell me your name, please? How many spirits are in this building? Lady Peckett, are you with us? Kind of some rumbling around out here. Mm. Like before. <laughs> third, you know, it's no real. No. said no. No. Honestly, I so much, so much just went no. I'm not fucking like yeah. I'm not. Honestly, I'm not hearing shit. I'm not fucking like. Oh wait, can you tell me your name, so <laughs> I'm fucking on my hat. I'm going. If you have anything to say at all, please say so now. It'll come on in a minute. I just want to ask you to tell me your name. Mr. Vice here. See the red light? Here, talk to me. Here, please. Can you send me your name, please? No! Okay. You heard that? Okay. You heard that, didn't you? Hmm. <laughs> just imagine it, right? Someone just went. This is happening. This is happening live.
That's brilliant. Mm -hmm. That's fantastic. Hands spirits are in this building. Lady Picky, are you with us? There's nothing, nothing else. What's the guys saying about that? Some are saying that they can't hear it. You know, you can't um, hear it, it. It's very, it, it's very mystery. strange. It's kind of a. You're not gonna hear it. It's not like a like a. It's not like a loud no. It's, it's a, not like a no. It's a coming through. No. Talk to me. Here, please. Can you send me your name, please? No, there, look. It's no. that. It's like a. It's like a. No. Mm. It's not like somebody just going no. EVPs don't yeah. work like that. Okay. It took me a while to hear it, to be honest. If EVPs got caught like that. No, I can hear that. I can hear that clear yeah. as a bell. Oh, I'll try and amplify it on something. It's like it's, it's like it's cutting Phil off when he's speaking. That's why it's difficult yeah, to it's hear. Like, it's like it's over him, yeah. yeah. It's like when... We're getting requests to hold it up to microphones and things. and It's just difficult, isn't it, with these phones? We can... We can hear it now. It's like when I go, can you tell me your name now? Someone goes, can you tell me your name now? It go out, yeah. Can you tell me your name now? I'll try and try and amplify it a little bit. All we probably might get through this is white signal noise. But I'm going to put that on a computer and I'm going to rip it. Yeah. Because I can hear it. Yeah, it's almost like a yeah, as if to go, I've had yeah. enough, leave me alone sort of thing. It was like sarcastic. Then. Yeah. I mean that to a ghost might be might be um, you know, just him talking normally, but it's just a device mm. frequency just capturing him. Maybe there's a ghost in here now talking to me, effing and blinding at me in my ear, you know. Mm. I can't hear him in my own ears. These devices record at a frequency what can hear him talk. This is what paranormal investigators is what theory say. This is not what I'm saying, okay? Mm -hmm. This is what I've learned from other people what I'm now delivering to you, okay? Do you know what I mean? Right, I don't know how this is going to happen. Okay, but we will do our best. That's not coming through this. I heard it again then. Mm. It's coming through again now. Okay. How many spirits are in this building? Talk to me. Talk to me. Here, please. Can you tell me your name, please? No. Yeah. Talk to me here, please. Can you tell me your name, please? I can hear it fairs a bell. This device here. See the red light? Here. Talk to me. Here, please. Can you tell me your name, please? Anyway, that's that's what that mm. is. It is what it is. Okay, done with that. Bored of that. <laughs> Bored of you. Now, whoever said no to me, that is absolutely fantastic. That is an EVP I've captured, which is um, which I'm impressed with, and I will find do my best at all my power to get that off that device onto a laptop 
and onto mm -hmm. an, an audio file and uh, upload it onto my channel because I think that is absolutely. F I can uh, argue, argue, Google it's, it's <laughs> not a, um, you know, it's not a class A, it's not a uh, class B, it's probably a class C, but I can hear with my own ears something. Can you tell me your name now? Just over when you're speaking. Just yeah. when I go, I don't even finish the word name. I don't even, I just, can you tell me your name now? What do I know? What do I know, Carla? Do you know Phil I mean? has had no drinks, no. What Sober do I know? as. I'm just high on life. <laughs> I'm happy to be alive after this week, you know what I mean? Can you believe, guys, I've had to have an ambulance to my house <laughs> because I've been that poorly? You know what I mean? I've been literally crawling on my hands. I've never, ever experienced anything like it in my life. Never. I've, never, I've been ill and I've had cold. I've had flu, but this. Wow. I've lost a stone in weight in four days. A stone. A stone, stone, stone one pound I've lost. I'm sweating now profusely. It's roasting in here, though, guys. But when I don't, when I, I get warm, I just, I just get a little bit, but I am dripping here. It is roasting though, isn't it? Whether I've still got a bit of summer, I don't know. So what we're going to do, guys, what I'm going to do is we're going to interact with these guys a little bit. Yeah. And see what's happening. How many people we've got. Um, yeah, thanks for coming on, guys. No, 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 you guys probably won't have heard that on the camera. It's you difficult, it's faint. It's, it's, it's it took different. me a while. It's, it's faint. Do you know what I mean? It's, it, it's faint. It's not class A. It's not a class A EVP. It's not. Mm. But I can hear it. You know? I can hear it. Carlos can hear it now. You know? And, uh, and I'm not gonna, um, I'm not just, I'm not gonna bullshit you guys and say, um, you know, you won't have heard it, you know? You won't hear it until I get on a computer mm. and I enhance it and I boost it, normalise it and I'll, you know, and you can hear it. Can you tell me your name? No. Interesting. So we've got the spirit. Got lost. So people, this is uh, this again. This is sweeping radio frequencies at such a fast rate that you know no clear words should come through. Um, it's sweeping at such a rate that um, no radio DJ should be talking through this. You know, so again we won't get things like up next is the. De Space Oddity by David Bowie, you know, we won't, won't get this kind of thing. We won't get that, you know, we won't, Lady Gaga is next, you know, we're not going to get that. No. Well, I'm just going to, oh, is, pull um, that from you, didn't I? All we're going to get is, we go. um... Just trying to get you in. We might get chops of radio, but if we get a clear word, like, hello, Michael, or something like that come through, that is something to be considered as being paranormal, okay? Number one rule around here, nothing you're watching here is said to be paranormal, okay? Nothing. Okay? But I want you to be open-minded, okay? The further call investigation, I was... I was... You cannot imagine the abuse I got for throwing a stick. Stick. If I was going to fake something, I'd, it'd be the groundbreaking evidence. Do you know what I mean? It'd be brilliant. I'd have tea, I'd have that TV and I'd throw it across the other side of the room. <laughs> Do more than throw a twig. You know, think about it guys, let's think about it. There we go. 
I'd like to spray it home set no on a digital recorder or just said to us now in general, can you give us a name to this person, please? If you're in this room, could you talk or move something, throw something in it? Touch one of us? Not, use anything in your power, whatever power you have got. Do it, right? If you want to talk, you can talk to us. Lady Peckett, my love. I believe this is where you slept, stayed, or... I'm stopping in this room. Whoa. Okay, I've got something touching my leg at the minute. You what? Got something touching my leg at the minute. You got something touching your leg? Yeah. The bottom level of my leg. Like my shin area. Don't know, but it just feels a little bit weird. Is anybody around here now, please? Someone's just said ghost cat. <laughs> Might be. Can you see where it's moving at the minute? It's kind of around there. Around here? Just a little bit higher. God, this looks weird, doesn't it? <laughs> it does look Jesus. weird. If anybody walked in there. <laughs> just looking for a ghost cat goat. What you Bless doing? it. No, it's bigger than a spider. I don't know in here. <laughs> well, <laughs> the knife's still young. No, it's a heavy. It's more of a heavy weighty feeling, not a spider. It's not like a light touch. It's like something resting or. Is there somebody affecting Carla in here, please? Is he attracted to Carla in any way? I'm going to stand in a different position, I think, as well, and see if it's... If you want to sit down, sit down on mm. the bed or whatever. You don't need to stand up. Yeah, have a minute, sit down on that mm. bed. Yeah. Okay. If we can kind of, kind of get the cameras sat. Mm. I mean, there's... <laughs> can I get up? Is it going to get up or what? <laughs> it is wonky, guys. So it's difficult to. Come on, then, if it's you, ghost cat, you are. Come on, my bed chicken. I like animals. You know what I might do? Sit in that bathroom in dark and Sit real. And I'm not even joking. I'm not even joking about it. I'll sit in that bathroom on my own. <laughs> in dark. Said that and I just jumped at my own fucking shadow. <laughs> Okay, the night is heating up. We believe we've got something. I've heard a clear no come through. Okay, there's somebody not wanting to say the name. That's fair enough. Mm -hmm. That's fair enough. That's fine. But if there is someone here, can, could you tell us that you are here? Okay. That's fine, you know. You don't want to tell us your name. That's brilliant. You fair enough. Well, can you confirm if there is someone here for us, please?
Is there a male or a female here? Who's the one that wanted to tell the name? Bullshit. No ghosts in here. There's nobody in here, is there? There's nobody. Nobody is there. The landlord. Okay. Let's get our money's worth. Right. The feeling of being strangled is being reported by both staff and customers standing at the mansion. Maybe we need to go down there. There's a lot of activity down there. Um, Lady Peckett, okay. Lady owned the Golden Fleece from. So you were the owner in 1701, okay? You'd have been in every room in this building. I'm in this room tonight, and I'm sleeping in here tonight. And, and uh, you can sit and you can watch me asleep, or you know, whatever you need to do. You know, whatever you need to do. Climb in bed with me if you want, duck, it's alright. But, you know, as long as you let yourself know. If any of this does happen, guys, expect me to jump out of bed and live stream it. Because I'm, I'm telling you now. If you get a notification at that o'clock in the morning, it's me. Petrified. Okay. Carl has got some bits and pieces, haven't we? Okay. We've got some stones. Crystals. 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 Mm-hmm. And um So what we're gonna do, we'll try something. I'm gonna get the uh manometer over here. And now we're gonna try something a little bit different. So if we put that there. Oh god, she's brock Carl, I've broken oh, no. I've broken her one, she's alright. Right, so we've got all these kind of stones and all these stones kind of have energy and you know more than me. Yeah, crystal, I mean, you get different energy from crystals. Some are for different things. Um, some of them are quite light as well. So again, they could probably move them if they really want to. And we've got pendulums as well, which again, spirit can move if they want to. Mm -hmm. So with the stones, are we talking about our... The spirits move them themselves or our guardian spirit moves them or it is open to interpretation really um pretty much like if anybody so this stone the... in my hand right now is not moving at all okay. no starting moving a little bit now yeah it was still okay so what do I so what I need to be asking what is my yes and no you can ask room? what is your yes what is your no um just so you've got an idea of responses for questions and things like that it just mm -hmm. gives you like a basis really for it so am i asking for a said spirit to move this for yes and you can or you can just say can you please tell me my yes can you mm. please tell me my no and then you can get to like different questions right, and then, things so. and can you tell me uh, spirit what a yes would be for me please So it's kind of going up and down, isn't it? So, yeah. It's a bit like a left and a right, isn't mm -hmm. it? And can you tell me which way you would go for no? We've got more of a back and forward. Or is so it a spinning? Like, is it a circle? Yeah. Mm -mm. We've kind of got a yes that way and a no that way. I mean, you can check it again because sometimes it can be a circle, sometimes it'll be backwards and forwards. So sometimes can you confirm be... your yes, please? So it's doing that for a yes. And can you confirm the no? It's like doing a circle. It's no, spinning, yeah, it's spinning. 
Okay, the so spirit. is there a spirit with us in here, please? That's the yes, isn't it? Yeah, we've got a yeah. Thank you very much. And does this spirit want to talk to us? Is this any spirit upset with us? Okay. Is this spirit the one that doesn't want to tell their names? So these are all yeses, aren't they? Really? Is there a reason why you don't want to say your name? Can you give us a no question? Okay. Are you male or female? Yes or no? Or are you, are you female? Yes or no? Are you male? Yes or no? Spinning now. So does that has is that our now? Was that a maybe? We had the circle, didn't we? Is the no? Do you mean any of us any harm in here? I'm not fucking. I'm not moving this at all. <laughs> My hand is as still as it possibly could be. That's a big no. So we take it that nobody's at harm tonight. Back into it, she yes, isn't mm. it? Have we had the ghost cat around to give him a look? Is the ghost cat with us? Is the ghost cat, you know, been making a fuss of Carla? The ghost cat has been making a fuss of you, Carla. I am a bit of a crazy animal lady, though, so. See if I stop asking any questions, so you see if it's just stuck. Yeah. Sometimes it'll rumble, like it'll just move a little bit, like sort of shake. And a lot of time it's now just... I can't get over it. Do you see the swing on that moments mm -hmm. ago? Lady Peckett, are you here? Yes. Oh no. Are we saying yeah? Looks like it didn't do it last time. Are you here, sweetheart? Yes or no? Is the inner another spirit than yourself with us here? Oh. <laughs> Yeah, we can try the stand as well, guys. Yeah, that's why I brought that one, just so everybody can have a look. That's free, man. So, yeah, don't worry about that. We can have a go with whatever. That's mad, that. So, we've got Lady Peckett with us. Yeah. We've also got a dowsing chart as well. We can always have a mess around with the dowsing chart and see if we can. 
Will this one? Yeah, That'll not work. Will it? Will it? Um, you kind of have to wrap them round on that one because I don't have any hooks, unfortunately, with me. Look what we've seen. Kind of like. You have to do it to a point where it's like tight, or you can tie one part of it. As long as the pendulum can still swing. So if I just put it in a knot, but not a tight knot. Yeah. And we can always try this way. Okay. Okay, now we've got to understand, okay. Can we have our yes movement, please? And can we have the no movement? I don't see what difference that would make, though. Mm. Personally, it's just it's more because what people always think is the thing that it's people swinging it basically and moving it well i can categorically say i wasn't swinging that around like uh wildfire but at the minute but is that i believe it's your energy what's moving it yeah you know, it's kind of your um your energy you're projecting out is the one thing what's moving it as what we've got here we've got you know it's, it's just idle there's yeah. no energy moving it and uh but it needs to get a little bit of momentum up, doesn't it? That kind of thing, that's what it needs. It's, um, it's definitely interesting, you know. It's definitely something I would never rule out. Um, it's definitely um, one to think about. So what's this stone then? That's amethyst. Amethyst? Yeah. I do tend to have a lot of amethyst. It's good for headaches and things like that as well. You can literally rub it on your head. It's the only Could thing. Could do with some of that. The only thing that cleared my migraine other than going to the hospital once. But I'm not saying that don't see your obviously your health professionals or anything like that. But I've had some bad experiences. And then obviously we've got these kind of stones as well. Interesting. Just going to get myself a quick drink of water. Yeah. And then what we'll do, we'll try some yeah. Paratec or something. How we doing, guys, on the Facebook? Got people watching on there. All good stuff, guys. Let's have a game, a little show around the room. There's something I'm not sure about that mirror. I'm not sure why. What's that? But I'm just not a fan of that mirror. I don't know. It says something about. Um, it's just strange to me. They say mirrors are like a portal as well, don't they? Mm. They say that um, spirits can use them as a portal, can't into mm. into this world. But yeah, I just don't know. I'm just not taking a liking to that mirror. I've had some weird mirror experiences myself, to be honest. You sent me that photo, didn't you? Yeah. I'll put, I'll put it on my page. <laughs> I'll put it on my page and let people have a look. Yeah, I'll have to see what you think to that one, guys. So if anybody is, you want, is using the mirror as a portal into the real world, you know? So we're under the assumption that we have got a um, you know 
the lady pick it with us tonight. So, which is all good. Which is all good stuff. So, but I'm still buzzing about the. Um, no. The EVP. The response here. Yeah. If I had my laptop here right now, I'd rip it and I'd put it straight on. So, thanks for getting... You guys who are just tuning in, I'm, I'm, I'm in the York. I'm in the Golden Fleece in York, which is the, which is known as like the most notoriously played, haunted places within York. Um, 2005, the place appeared on Most Haunted. Um, that's just this phone. And... Um, it's all good and, and all experiences these people's been having. People's been stood at the bar and been felt like they've been having their hair pulled and things like that and it's weird stuff. If I go home tonight with that EVP, I'd be happy with that. I'd be happy with that. Can you tell me your name? No. Mm. I could retire on that. So this uh, this device, what we're using now, guys, is a um, it's a much I must uh, stress that it's a much debated tool within the paranormal. It's um, a, a lot. It divides the paranormal in half, basically. It's um, very fifty-fifty what people believe, but isn't that the case for everything? Isn't that the case for you know every tool? Do you know what I mean? But there's people out there who feel so strongly about this. Do you know what I mean? But I'm sceptical to a degree, but all I'm going to say, most of my good evidence I've found is from using this. You know? And people what has been following me from a long, for a long time will know that from the Stocksbridge Bypass, from, you know... You know, from the especially this was a highlight at Stocksbridge when I was asking for things like, "What is it you want from me?" Straight away, we got your soul. <coughs> um, and uh, and later in the video, I asked, "Do you want us to leave?" And it literally says, "Get out." I've never had that those words come through since then. Um, I had an unusual like, on the on the railway bridge. I got the word rape. I've now had that come through before, so it kind of rules out duplicate words. I have had had duplicate duplicate words come from previous investigations and things like that, but I'm looking for the really unique words to come through, unique enough that they are direct responses to what I'm saying. So it's um, it's very interesting, and it's just an experiment which we will try to do. And we want to talk to Lady <clears throat> Pecky. I believe that the stone was telling me that she's the only one here. Possibly ghost cat, but we're not going to hear from the cat. <laughs> Bless it. So the first word we've got is Thomas come through. Okay. So I'll open that up a little bit. Okay, but we've not asked any questions, so we won't. Okay, the spirit or spirits, Lady Pecky. Hard. Hard. Okay, right. This device is sweeping for any changes in the air, etc. So this is basically what a ghost could use to talk. Lady Pecky, my love. Uh, are you at rest where you are? Are you happy? Thing. Thing. Are you happy? I mean, you was the owner, wasn't you, my dear? You own this grand establishment in 1701 with your husband, John. Okay, did you have a happy life here? Was it good? Was things good here? I believe this was your room. 90. 90? Is this an age? It said that you walk around these rooms and you walk around these corridors. You know? 
Is this true? In fact, are you with us now? Come sit down in the bed, my lord. Edward. Edward. Is this a name on here? Density. Actually. Lady Pickett, come on now. Let's talk to you. I want to hear details regarding you. Okay, <coughs> I believe you're here. You own this place. Thanks. What have you got to say to us tonight? Somebody spoke to us already on the EVP. Admittedly, it wasn't very clear, but with you know, with if he was in the room, you could hear it. Okay. So. Terry. I'm getting names. I'm getting names. Itself. Itself. Terry. Thomas. Saint. Saint. Give us something, you know. Do you want us in this room? Are we? Are you happy? Are you happy that we're? Um, we'll be stopping Can't you. Can't do that. Oh. <laughs> okay. That's a weird string of words. Can't do that. Why can't? No. Oh, why can't I do that? And why will that be trouble? Usual. Oh yeah. Will I get the usual? Will I? What will happen? Go on, my love. Can't do that. Why? Why? Can't do that. Why? Either. Either. Either what? Either what? Manor. Manor? This is your manor, is it? I've paid to stop in here, my love. Um, so, um, why, why will it be true? Indeed. Indeed. You're threatening me, my love. I'll be in this bed tonight. Trouble again, I can't believe it. I can't believe it. I'm going nuts here. I'm going nuts. I'm, I'm, I'm at, is this some kind of weird alternative reality? Reality, or is this saying it? Is that just a, oh. Okay. You're a nasty woman, aren't you, Lady Peckett? Horrid. Oh, yes, you are horrid. Oh, wow. You are horrid, aren't you? You don't like me at all, do you? I don't want you to like me. I'm not coming here to make you up make friends with you. Horrid. Trouble. Gonna give me trouble. Informed. I've been informed, have I? It's like I'm having a direct conversation with you, my love. Alice. I'm gonna, I, I feel as though I know you that much. I'm going to call you Alice. So. Okay. Upper. Do we need to go above or what? Alice. I've gone beyond calling you Lady Pecky. I'm going to call you Alice. It's like I'm having a conversation with you, my love. It's like lady. <laughs> yeah, she's a lady. You've I'm got, going, you've I'm got to call a lady. Am I going nuts? Am I, Carla, Carla, Carla? Yes. You've got to call a lady. You can't just call her Alice. Carla, Carla, is this happening or what? 
It is. Person. Yeah, she's a person. Oh, I can't fucking handle this. Is that, have I just said I'm called, calling you Alison? Is that, has that not just said, like, lady? No. Right, guys, watching at home. Right, right, you guys watching at home. Lost. Right, you explain to me, right, why I started referring to this woman by her first name and that has just said lady. Okay, you telling me that this woman is a trouble, horrid, while I've been in talking to her in a very dis. dis <coughs> I can't speak this disrespectful manner. Okay. Okay, lady. Three. Can't believe it. I can't fucking believe what I'm fucking doing. Right. Right. So we've got to call you lady, have we? Okay, I've got you. Sorry, guys. Okay, you did. Okay. I can't believe it. I cannot believe that. Are the guys, are, are the guys, the witness, are the guys saying yeah. anything about it? Are they, are they, uh, yeah, I, I might nightmare. nightmare. Okay. I'm going to need to plug in in a minute, guys. You might have a bit of a kerfuffle oh, going on. I feel like crying. I th honestly, I feel so upset and furious by this because I can't. Because people, people, people are saying that I'm crackers. People are saying mm. that I'm mental. Information. Information. Yeah, there's a cable around somewhere. There is like some cable around. I'm actually having doubts in my own head, thinking that I'm going crazy. Mm. That's why I want to know if this is happening. Is this real? Is this some kind of alternate reality I'm living in? Am I dreaming this? Did I, did I, did I, or did I not? Turn that off a minute. Did I? stopped. Okay. I started getting a little bit clever with this lady. I started getting, like, getting her a little bit of lip, okay? She said she was horrid, okay? She was gonna do trouble. And then I said, I'm not gonna call you lady anymore. I'm gonna call you Alice. Okay, Alice, lady came through. Okay? It's if to say, you call me lady. I am just so in such and such state of shock. I can't. I just can't. I just don't know. I don't. I don't know what's happening, Carla. <laughs> I just don't know what's going on. What would be brilliant now, lady, Pecky, is if you could talk now for us. Let's hear your voice. I'm calling you lady now because this is obviously what you want me to call you. I apologise for talking to you in a disrespectful manner. You know, I, um, I've only done that to provoke some kind of reaction, a reaction I have been given by you. And I applaud that gratefully. You've given me some fantastic debatable evidence I can take to show people who will then continue to call me absolutely crazy but that's not the point okay so what's happening here Lady Becky is that this is sweeping the radio waves in the air and it's allowing you to talk basically 
I hope that were a guest. Okay. The next door is on off. Uh, it's it's upstairs. It's all the way upstairs. That was this door. It just went. We've got your attention, haven't we, Doc? I like it. Who we got? Who we got? Carla, I can't get over that, that Paratech. Yep. I can't get over, I need to, I, I need to clip that, I need to put that, I need to, oh God, that was mad. That was absolutely crackered. Someone's tried either a human being or somebody else, somebody's tried to tempt it coming into this room with us tonight. Okay. All right. I'm, re I'm preparing myself for what I want to do next, but I'm a bit worried about it. I'm going to sit in that bathroom on my own in dark. Are you going to stay here or you want to go downstairs or whatever? I I want this lady to myself. It is a short door. I want this last to myself. This lady. I want her to give me all the wrath. I think I've got her attention. And I think uh, she wants to play. So I'm, I want to play too, so uh, that's, that's somebody. That's yeah. Somebody. Um, I'll give back. <laughs> We're in the dark now, lady. Um, I'll do. Right. We're going in here. We're sitting in here. Do you Will you shut this door, Carla? Lady Peckett, my dear love, I believe you've made brilliant communication with me tonight. Um, but what I want is I want some kind of um, some kind of like physical, you know touch from you, some kind of physical um, movement of an object or something.
Okay, there's plenty of objects in here which you can use, you can throw, you can drop. It's all good stuff. So, did I, if I upset you in any way, I apologise. You gave me some fantastic evidence there and I'm very pleased about it so thank you very much but I, what I want is I want some kind of physical evidence here right now I want you to use all the energy that is available to manifest I say manifest What I'm doing guys, I'm running an experiment in the dark, okay, for my own ears and hopefully you can hear something move. Yeah, one, like I say, my ears will come alive at night, you know, you know, and those senses will come in later on. But you guys have got to admit that Paratech session was pretty intense and pretty. It was almost as though I was having a conversation with this person, you know, and it's um, it's the best evidence I've found in a long time. So if you just be quiet and just listen for a minute. Not really feeling much at the minute. Okay, we'll try, we'll go back out. Can you just open this door, Carla, for me, please? So you've been all right out there? Yeah, fine. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna play that EVP back from before. objects in this room you can throw Lady Peckett <laughs> you didn't like it when I called you Alice did you my love that upset you didn't it Can you move the door for us, please? Give the door a little wobble, go on. We know you can talk to us. Let us know you can like interact with us in the um, real world. Why won't you just lay it that door just move? I'd absolutely jump out my wherever I am laid here. I 
absolutely crackers in here, boys. So, Yes, we are. Lady Pecky, I believe you've been talking to us this evening. Can you give us your voice, please? Can you tell us your first name, please? And can you confirm you are the one who has been making contact? Do you mean me any harm? Am I bothering you being here? Did I disrespect you earlier? And again, oh, like a whoosh noise. And can you confirm you are the one who's been making contact? What? what? <sighs> Summit, it's like another voice, dear. 
It's not us breathing though, guys. You know what I mean? It's not us doing it. I believe you've been talking to us this evening. Can you give us your voice, please? Yeah, I'm like a wash. It's not as good as the, uh, no. no. And can you confirm you are the one who's been making contact? <sighs> is that... <laughs> That's, it's something there, I can't make out what it is. Can you tell us your first name, please? Can you confirm you are the one who's been making contact? <sighs> to me, it's almost like a... <sighs> Somebody's getting mad with us, man. As if to go leave me alone. What's that noise? <laughs> Isn't it? Sounds like a blow coffin. That's weird. I can't tell what it is though. Mm. Kind of strange, right? I'm just gonna pass you that there. I want to play that EVP, EVP back from earlier, where you know, for guys, anyone's just just jumped in from earlier. Um, pretty crazy to be honest. Um, the best EVP I think I've ever um, found. I it's not um. It's not jump out clear mm. at you, you know. It doesn't. It, it might take a couple of listens to get it, but it's there. And um, I'm impressed with it. And if I can try and find a way of getting it off, I will. I'll get it off. Yeah. Yeah. Well, what we've got, what we've got is when I say, can you? Yeah. I can hear it every day. I can, I can keep listening to that all day. I can hear that every day of the week. Sorry, but I can retire on that. I'm happy with that. <laughs> that is my... Uh, that's my thought and my opinion. I can hear that. Um, might not be able to pick it up on uh, the, the phones, microphones. At the end of the day, the phone microphones. I mean, we haven't got like a thousand dollar equipment and that. You know what I mean? Where we're going to get uh, audio... Can you know full audio a full audio experience Dolby mm. surround sound uh, experience? You know what I mean. But all I can do to back up that claim is just basically just have to rip that, put it in a computer, and just bump up, bump it up, and uh, see the just see the waveform for it. You know, and 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 that is what I will do. The Paratech session went absolutely uh, phenomenal, and we're going to try it again. Uh, but. Mm. It's, I've just, it's just absolutely just shocked me, you know what I mean? <laughs> it's just, um, I can't believe what I did. That, I, if you watch that bit back, it was like almost as though the, the, the woman was just talking and she was in the room with us. Do you know what I mean? It's, mm. what do I know, Carla? What do I know? I don't, I know, no, I don't know, no, I don't know anything. <laughs> 
I'm just an idiot on internet, you know what I mean? Just uh, talking to himself and that, you know what I mean? I don't know. Oh. Okay, we're scanning. So, if you're still here, lady, take it, my dear. Um, we believe that you've done a fantastic job tonight, and we're wanting to talk to you some more for us tonight. I'm sorry that I disrespected you in any way. Um, I, you know, I really do apologise for that. You know, but it did get it did get Jenny. It did get a rise out of you, didn't it? And we did get some communication from you, didn't you? And that's why I do these little provocation tactics to um, get the evidence I need. When nothing's happening, I start shaking a stick at it, you know? And I, I do things just to um, provoke, to get the best evidence I need. Happy. Who's tapping? Is this something you normally do? Do you normally tap? Is that one way of communicating? Or is that the frustration thing of... Save. Save. Bar. 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 Okay. That's Brianna. Enough. That's another area where um, it's supposed to be really, that's a lot of activity. Yeah, know, people having there grabbed and things. And... But there's, there's, there's customers in there, they're not going to get out what they want. They're just going to look at how they've got out. Is it worth going down though, with cameras, now everyone's had a drink, to ask? Yeah. Ask people if they've ever had anything weird happen while they've been in here. Do we need to go to the bar area? Adjective. Who's the prominent spirit down at the bar area? Who's the one that pulls hair? Can you tell us that please? Spirit what was with us? The question I would like to ask if, is, is this spirit afraid of any other spirit in this building? Usually. Okay, you're usually scared of another spirit in this, you know, establishment? And whose name's that? Who, who do we call this person? Carter. We call him Carter. That's just one. Yeah, sorry guys, we're just buffering again now. Which right one's now. buffering? YouTube. YouTube. As normal. If you want a better experience, guys, just go to Facebook. Always constantly good stuff I'm dead. stuff happening on on do I, I really highly suggest if you want a good quality of live stream go to Phil Sinclair Paranormal Investigations, like the page and watch it on there. Okay. Wall, okay. We're gonna need to we're gonna need to get this back, okay, because I, I think people just sat outside his room laughing taking yeah. piss. And I weren't and I weren't having that and I've told them yeah. Talk. Talk. It's because you're not talking, having a conversation, mm. are you, at the minute? 
Are you trying to talk or is it you want is it you want me to talk more? I'm just in a really negative mood. Like I really want to have a blowout with somebody. Again. Talk again. Right? I don't know, I've just come over really negative. Like I'm really like if anybody if anybody does anything right now like I'm 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 seething right now that I want to start screaming at chat you know what I mean if anybody mm -hmm. if I see something I don't want to if I see something I don't want to see I'm gonna start having ranting and I'm not gonna do it I want to keep it um... yeah. A lot of bang, fear, mm. talk, again. I'm talking again, okay? You don't, Text. You don't need to fear us. Okay. I've got your attention, I know that. I've wound, the, I've mm -hmm. wound my attitude back. Zero. My attitude has gone back, okay? Because I've got the evidence I needed from that moment. I started getting cocky. I got, I got, you know, I was provoking. I got what I needed from that, and I took a step back. Okay, I wasn't going to take that any further. I got all I need. I got all the responses I needed from that. The gap. So, is there spirits coming forward? Is there spirits coming back? You know, is there someone? here with us is there a cat here you know i know a cat can't talk but can you tell me that there's a cat here you know is there, can you tell us that there's a cat um with us is has there a cat been in this room i know the cat can't speak for himself but glance glance again i've heard that a couple of times who's glancing is somebody glancing here Glancing at me. Lady Peckett, do you upset my form of apology for the way I spoke to you earlier? Interest. Does my apology interest you? Would you be interested in hearing, like, accepting my apology? Question. Okay. Fire away. Ask me your question. Ask me a question. That's that, that's fine. Not resting. You're not resting. Past. 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 Not resting. Past. Not <laughs> resting. Pa oh, calm down. Phil. Not okay. resting. Past. So you. So you're saying you're not resting because you're aware you're past, i.e. passed away, left this world into another world. Right. Can you tell us this world, please, where you are? Next. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, right. There. So when, can you tell me that when I pass, there was, will be something next waiting? What will be next? 13. I thought she said to me age, but I'm not 30, 32. What will be next? Tell tell me, tell Carla, tell the people watching at home what is what 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 is there after this where I am now. What's what is that what is there? Where oh. hole Is it darkness? Is it complete darkness? Again.
Can you tell us where is is there a heaven or hell? Do we is is, is there a place? Female. I honestly do believe this lady is with us, you know, here in this mm. room. We got it from the stone confirming it. We got it from the Paratech earlier session, which basically was just like... Is. A... Is. Female is. Mm-hmm. Is female. Will he be watching over me tonight? To get. Are you going to, are you, are you to get me tonight? I'll be laid asleep in this room tonight. Will he be with me then? Bottom. Bottom of where? Where will you be the bottom of? You meant. You, you what? I meant what? You often stay in this room. No. I literally thought that said no, but it said no. But I would have bounced around if that said no. Are you aware that we're here and we're talking to you? Bellev. It says Bellev, but the word actually is believe. Kept. Kept. Do you like to keep things kept? Decomposed. Why have we had that twice? Again. Why have we had that word decomposed twice? And what a word and all, decompose. It, yeah. What's decomposing in this room? Or has decomposed? Orb. Orb? Do orbs exist? Can you appear in, or in an orb? A spirit energy? Violet. Violence. Violence. Object. Is, is something explaining that some violence has happened causing someone to... And someone's been undiscovered, like someone's yeah. here, maybe it's in a... Has, some, has a body been found? Yeah. It's like there's some urgency to find something. I'm interested to know, Deacon... Joe. I think I've heard of a Joe here before. Okay. I don't know if anyone else can confirm that or find out, but I think I think Joe was present on one of the most haunted investigations. I think. Yeah. I think. Uh, Lady Peckett, is John with you as well? He's still uh, in this building together. Intent. Did you have a happy relationship together when you were running this establishment? Palette. Palette. 
Was it your palace? It was a palace, yeah. The cross. They've said that you have a really sweet smell, uh, Lady. Danny. I'm not fearing nobody, thanks. You see, I'll bet a lot of the activity will happen the in the night. Yeah. You know, when, when it's really quiet and down. Mm -hmm. I think that's when we will get a lot of the activity, like with our own ears yeah. kind of thing, where we're away from the phones and where we where it you know, catches, you off, catches you off guard kind of thing. Mm -hmm. I'd, I'd, I'd love um, like I've got I've got visions that I'm gonna have, visions that I'm gonna open the door and there's somebody in there you know what I mean. Wouldn't you just love to have this building to yourself though? You know what I mean. And, mm. uh, and that's it. That's just not talking. About it's because it's stopped. because I think it wants you to like bring on a conversation and things. Have you noticed when I stop talking? It just, it's just mumble yeah. jumble coming out. Immersion. No, 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 no. no. Because I'm not, I'm not, I'm not. Yeah. I'm not get, get talking to it directly. And this is where you've got to. Um, this is how you've got to use this device. Yeah, maybe it's Brad. But maybe it's that. Maybe it's just a random word generator. Maybe it is. I'm not. I'm not yeah. disputing it. You know. Maybe it is. All I'm saying is that when I started I talking to this Lady Alice by her first name, we get the word lady come through. Yeah, I weren't happy with that. And she was saying that there would be trouble if I carried on keep calling her Alice. And then you might have noticed on the earlier video I started getting really provocative, provoking, and because nothing was happening and you've got sometimes you've got to really You've got to really start digging the digging the knife in, you know, to um, get a reaction. You know what I mean? Do you know what I'm saying? Mm. It's not a tactic I like to use, and it's not uh, something I like to go around doing. But sometimes you've got to give that little bit of um, So we've got decompose can work through twice. Can you give us any details regarding a death? Can you give us any details regarding your husband John? Can you give us any new details about yourself? Maybe this is something not written down what we don't know about. Have you thought about the apology I've offered? Have you considered the apology? Do I am, I am I forgiven for disrespecting you? Is any spirit willing to talk now? now? Would a uh, spirit like to come sit down beside us here? Just have a conversation with us.
remember the last investi investigation we did when we got witches going through? Mm -hmm. Can we see some physical activity in the room? I bet you any money, then all this will be happening when we're... Um... Yep. What I'd like to do is I'd like to thank all the spirits that has been made contact with us tonight. Still does that there, Paul. Yeah. So I want you to let me know your thoughts as evidence. I want you to let me know um, you know what you thought, questions I should have asked, your thoughts, your your theories. You know what I mean? But I think what we found tonight has been incredible. And um, do please do expect live streams in the, from the early hours of the morning. So if you get a notification, something crazy would have happened. So um, it's going to be pretty good. Uh, the evidence is will will just the evidence is just what it is. It's happened live. Um, the EVP I'm so chuffed to bits with. I'm so happy. I will be ripping that off at some point when I get home tomorrow. Onto the um, Laptop, and I will be uploading that audio file for you guys. Um, I'd like to thank everybody for just coming on and watching this little bit of an investigation tonight. It's been really good, and I am really appreciate that you've chose to spend your time with me. Really humbled. It is a really nice feeling to know that people have, you know, wanted to spend some time. And if you're watching this after, you know, after it's been broadcast. That is absolutely fantastic too, and that you know you all mean so much to me. And this is the reason why I do it, not only because I uh, want to look for the best, of, you know, my own personal journey in the paranormal. I want to bring you guys along on the journey as well. So you know, if you want to see more content, like the pages, you know, subscribe to the channel. You know, there's more to come. There's more years in my life yet to do. There's more places in the UK to do. There's more places around the world to do. You know what I mean? Do you know what I mean? I'm not planning on going anywhere just yet. So, just a sub, just a like on the page. It helps grow these things. And um, let everybody know. Tell your friends about Phil Sinclair Paranormal Investigations. Let me, if you like, if you like my style of investigating. You know. And this is what I do. I've got, I feel as though I've got my own, I've got something different nipped off of the paranormal field. I feel as though I've got something, to, something different to, Put on the table, you know what I mean, and um, I'm not. I'm not. Everyone's gonna um, in, enjoy that, and people are not always gonna um, disagree. People will probably disagree with that, with how I need to investigate, and disagree with how I didn't investigate. In, 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 people will disagree with the ways I investigate, and that is absolutely fine. Okay. No malice on my part regarding other par paranormal teams. You, I respect you all, and individual as individuals. Um, do you know what I mean? I'm just doing this just for my uh, own peace of mind. You know what I want to do. You know what I mean? I won't stand on your toes. You know, and, and that's how it is. So it's all good stuff. 
and thank you all for watching guys you know what i mean it, it's uh, it is what it is the evidence is what we've got is what we've got and that's how it is and that's just how the cookie crumbles and i can't believe i've just said that um <laughs> um it just it, it, my favorite word at the minute is it is what it is because carla it is what it is it is what it is so um again I hope you have a nice sleep tonight, guys. I hope, I hope you have a great day at work and whatever you need to be doing tomorrow. Um, and thanks for supporting Phil Sinclair's Paranormal Investigations. And there'll be more to come, and probably more to come tonight, in all honesty. So uh, thanks a lot, guys. Have a good night.